Hey guys, all right, this next one, it's a, it's a file that's actually, I have a hot string for it in my main script. Um, I think of it as MSA, message box alternative is how I remember. So MSA period space, um, that pulls up a reference to this function that's in my function library. And basically it's a, it's a resizable GUI and we'll jump to that thing in a second, but I'm gonna run it here and hit my hotkey to launch it. And so you can see it displays it in this alternative GUI. Um, I, did, I think I just mentioned this in the, uh, the the last Udemy course I did, intermediate course, but uh, yeah, you can get an idea. It's, it's very, sometimes you want to have one. Sometimes, you know, I usually dump it to this output window, but sometimes it's nice being able to have one that has scroll bars on it, uh, and that's it. So let me go ahead and exit out of it. And then in Studio, you highlight it, you're in it, and hit Alt, oh, let's try it again. Let me refresh. Alt F1, and I'll jump to it. And here you can see, so there's the text you shove into it. Here you can also, I, I give default values of 900 by 600, but you can change that, right? And then this is just the GUI. I don't work with GUIs. Maestria did this for me um, between the two of us. He, he, you know, I customized it and he, he wrote it. But uh, let's go back into here. So if I was to put in here are some numbers. This is the great thing about Studio 2, right? It shows you where you are in those parameters. So I'm going to make this 500 by, uh, let's say 700. So, and I rerun it, and now it starts off at that size. But if I was to make this, let's say make it um, 800 by 700. So it's a great, it's, I, I love this, you know, I don't know why I don't use it more other than because I have this output window, otherwise I would. But uh, I'll, uh, I'll post both of these, um, hopefully, in the uh, uh, video comments. If not, I'll post a link um, to it. Cheers.